morning, everyone. Welcome back to Flight Attendant Justin. I look so orange with this lighting. Holy cow, I promise I am not orange. This is so weird. Um, welcome back to Flight Attendant Justin. We're future Flight Attendant Justin. Today I am off to Portland Airport. It is 4.50 in the morning. Um, I am catching a flight to Orange County. Super excited. This weekend was originally supposed to be a Disney weekend, but um, instead, we are, and by we I mean my best friend and I, are going to just do like Newport Beach and Huntington Beach and kind of just chill and hang out before um, all of the craziness is about to start. So I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a really good weekend. I think tonight, yeah, tonight we're going to do like downtown Disney and watch the fireworks and eat dinner and stuff. And then tomorrow and Sunday will be beach days. So I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a good weekend. Right now, I'm currently waiting for my Uber, which is eight minutes away. Uh, I guess people don't Uber at this hour. And it's $25 to get to the airport, which is way cheaper than parking, but still. So, it'll be a good weekend, and here we go. got to John Wayne Airport. It is actually quite nice in here, again with the orange, but it's quite nice. It's sunny outside. It's kind of busy, but like not terrible. My friend Alex is going to come have lunch with me and we're going to do that and it'll be a lot of fun. And then I'm going to come back and wait for Katie to arrive at the airport and then we're going to go and check into the Airbnb. I'm excited for lunch because we're going to Earth Cafe. Well, we had a little car funkle, and by we, I mean I, and my mood temporarily shifted, but we're back better than ever. Katie is here. We're in California. Super stoked to be here. Right now, we're, we're going to, I don't think we know where we're going to eat, but we're going to downtown Disney to get our magical vibe. Just what we need right now. Um, I don't really know what there is to do. Build-A-Bear Workshop, that's always a fun and overpriced activity. Target, your local Target. Target, oh my god, so we were taking an Uber from the airport and our Uber driver was like pointing out every single thing and I just was not in a good mood and he was like, you should go to the CVS or like a movie or... Okay, I think I'm rambling at this point. Got a spray tan, if you have not caught on to that trend from my earlier videos. I look so orange in my earlier videos, it's bad. It was nice. I got, I dyed my hair so it's a little blonder. Yeah, so. I look, we look hot. <laughs> like we could go and sit on a Hawaiian beach right now and drink a mimosa and well it is five o'clock but okay enough rambling. Disney time. <laughs> downtown Disney, Katie. In downtown Disney, people definitely just turn around because we're vlogging and they laughed. Did they not? Oh god, uncomfortable. Anywho, we are in downtown Disney. It is popping. It is definitely a Friday night. We're currently trying to figure out where to eat. Katie is borderline hangry, I think. Um, salt and straw is definitely, definitely an option for tonight, but still haven't figured that out, so. I want it too. Okay, just wanted to update everybody on where we chose for dinner. Um, so because we love corporate America, we chose Cheesecake Factory. Always a solid option, prices are like, not as high as downtown Disney, and like... We get an extra walk in. Extra walk, good bread. Good cheesecake. Oh, are we getting cheesecake? I have to get a piece of cheesecake. <laughs> Everyone that I go to Cheesecake Factory with always is like, no, we don't want to eat that. Oh my gosh, red velvet cheesecake oh is my God. to die for. Well, how about we just get our own and then we can eat half tonight and half in the morning. Sounds good. All right. And we can shoot. It's vacation. Good morning, good morning. Day two of three in beautiful California. Today, we are going to Newport Beach. 
which in my opinion is the best beach on the west coast. We're going to uh, paddleboard and sit on the beach and read a book, except I forgot my book, so love that. Probably just watch Netflix or something. And then, I don't know what else we're gonna do. Might celebrate Cinco de Mayo, because it's Cinco de Mayo weekend. And yeah, kinda just hang out and chill. The original plan was to take you along on our paddleboarding journey, but I was too nervous that I would drop my camera in the ocean. So enjoy these pictures in a lovely slideshow setting. Now we are going to get bonsai bowls, which bonsai makes me think of Red Robin and when we would always go to Red Robin for dinner, but um, they're actually acai bowls. We're gonna get that and then go to the beach. We got some white claw and coronas. So it's just gonna be a chill afternoon on the beach. Gonna watch TV and here we go. live at Newport Beach. This is hour three of being on the beach. For those who know me, that is an accomplishment. Normally at this point I am ready to go. Oh yeah, I can't just sit still on the beach. That is not my style. Mm -mm. Nope. It's five o'clock. All right, I say we stay here till six. And then we'll find a happy hour soon? And then we're gonna find out. Well, six is a little late for a happy hour, but. Oh, I guess four to six is like yeah. Four to six, yeah. Hey, what's up? It's Katie. I'm taking over Justin's vlog for right now. He is right next to me, he says I should do a guest vlog, um, but to be honest, I think we stayed a while this now. is really not my forte. Name grade fun fact. Uh, that was me in the previous vlog. Name grade fun fact. <clears throat> my name is Katie. Don't have a grade anymore. Fun fact is I can sing the alphabet backwards. So the point of this segment of the vlog is to discuss how nice these houses are. Like, they're so nice. And they are on the boardwalk. See what? Well, we passed this house that had like girls with keystone light in their hands saying, I'm effed up. And it just took me back to game day, really. A lot of shirtless douchebags. Oh, that's probably going to get edited out of the vlog. but. Eh, probably won't. So, golden hour is approaching. In life, in California, can't wait to be in bed. I think we're gonna watch comedy, take a shower, cuddle. cuddle. Good times, really, good times. Please give us an update on what just happened. <laughs> so, we're walking down the street and minding their own business on our phone. <laughs> I'm on one side to the left. God, we should have just taken a freaking Uber. I wanna... It's, well, I think that's the sunburn, but... Oh my God. I feel like I need to go to the emergency room. That doesn't look swollen. Can you wiggle those toes? Yeah. Good. Does it hurt? Well, can you like feel and assess it? Was, what do you think I'm doing? I'm assessing. Can you... Okay, bend... Like, do like this. Like a ballerina? Yep. And then flex it. Good. And roll it. Good. So is it broken? Nope. 
Just bruised. <laughs> <laughs> we just made it back to the Airbnb. We are both not well. We're both burned, which I think is impacting our emotional and physical states. This hair is really bad. Okay, good night. We will see you in the morning. Good night. You're not going to sleep well as you watch this video, but I hope we sleep well and we'll see you in the morning. Ciao. Ciao. Cheers. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's day three. Today is going to be a great day. And do you know why? Because <laughs> every day is a great day. Duh. We're starting our day with McDonald's. So no judgment from anyone, please. It was um, sounding really good when we woke up. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Oh, yeah. Maybe we'll get tacos to celebrate this stupid holiday that... You can't say that. <laughs> why? You know that, like, Cinco de Mayo is not celebrated in Mexico, right? I know, but... Yeah, I know. Ugh, God, I have to cut that out. Okay. We decided that today we are going to go to Fullerton, which is north by about 20 minutes. The deciding factor was that that's the closest Lululemon, and while, yes, there are Lululemons in Oregon, it's just so much more fun to buy them in California. So we're currently waiting for our Uber. It's a Honda Civic. Love that. Um, we are both scorched burned. I don't know if I've mentioned that, but yeah, today's idea of a beach day has been diminished to shopping, coffee, and celebrating Cinco de Mayo. So, oh god, there's the Airbnb host. Oh god. I leave for flight attendant training in a week. I'm very excited. Um, it's gonna be crazy. We are about to embark on this journey together, and I am so excited. I am very nervous as well. There's lots of tests, lots of like drills that we have to do, and just a lot of stuff to learn. There's training six days a week for nine hours a day, which is gonna be a lot. And then we do two service flights, and then we do a final like check flight and gonna be fun. So I think I could use a margarita right now. Probably not gonna include that in the vlog because drinking is not something that that's alive. Yeah. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo is significant in the United States because I don't know. I need to learn my history better. Good morning, it is go home day. We are just cleaning up the Airbnb, getting ready to head back to, what? My elevator. Yes, Katie is um, super adamant about getting to the airport with enough time to get through security. And Starbucks. And Starbucks, that is true. So we are going to take an Uber or Lyft in this torrential downpour of a rainforest to John Wayne Airport, and then we're gonna board our flight and we're gonna go home and yeah, all in all, it's been a great trip. Le yesterday was so much fun celebrating Cinco de Mayo with all of our apple juice. And yeah. Just made it through security at John Wayne Airport. I know that I've said this before, but I'll say it again. TSA pre-check is so worth it. I got through in four minutes and Katie is still in line. So get pre-check, moral of the story. This airport is beautiful. Again, people are staring at me with vlogging. I think one of my flight attendants that I have on this flight is the same that I had on the inbound, so... Love that. We just got back to Portland, or we got back to Portland like two hours ago, but it was kind of a carfunkel in getting back to the apartment. Um, and friends who go to California together also go to urgent care together. So Katie's tonsils are the size of a pretzel. Um, that's a bad analogy, but like 
like there's that. like maybe a centimeter between her two tonsils and then her airway, so we love that. And then I ran into a power pole in California and I'm, what is it, hypochondriac? I'm a hypochondriac and I'm worried that I cracked my foot, so I'm just gonna get an x-ray and make sure that it's okay. Um, tonight we are going to Lyon, which is super exciting. Um, and it's just gonna be a good week. I have a good feeling about it. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed our trip to California. Many trips to come as Katie is going to be my travel buddy. Super excited. I know, she's really stoked about that. Um, we are already planning trips to Spain and Australia and England and Germany and just like so many different places and we cannot wait. So feel free to subscribe down below if you wherever below is. If you have not yet already, feel free to like, comment, share, blah, blah, blah. Okay, have a good day. Bye.